All right, guys, I wanted to do a quick video on goon tape and my thoughts on it. I've had a lot of people recommend uh, goon tape as far as a grip tape for your firearm. Um, I know you can actually buy grips that are made specifically for your gun from certain companies that are already pre-cut out that you can slap on there that fits up, you know, everything perfectly and fits around the mag release and everything like that. But I wanted to go the grip tape route. So um, everyone was saying, you know, goon tape is awesome. And there's some people saying it's literally hockey tape. So I figured I'd buy some different grip tapes and figure it out myself. So that's exactly uh, what I did. Um, so I have goon tape here. I have Howie's cloth hockey tape. I have Element 26 uh, lifting tape, which someone else on uh, YouTube recommended that you can get on Amazon. I have Howie's stretchy grip tape and Howie's pro grip tape. Um, so first and foremost, I'm gonna go ahead and get the goon tape situation out of the way. Guys, you are literally overpaying for hockey tape. I am not kidding you. I think I spent $4 on this roll from Howie's uh, hockey tape, and I think this one was $7.99 per roll from Goon Tape. I can't say for sure 100% if they actually have it uh, listed in wording on the Goon Tape site that says these are four firearms and such, but even if they don't, they definitely market it towards that. Obviously, it's called Goon Tape, for, first of all, and second of all, it has pictures of Goon Tape wrapped around AKs and ARs and pistols and all that sort of stuff. So they definitely market it towards that crowd if they don't. Um, so, guys, this is hockey tape. Look, I mean, if you can see it, it's the same. It's When you pull it, let's see if I can do it. When you pull it, it stretches the same, which isn't very much, honestly. Um, stretches the exact same. It feels the exact same. It has the same shimmer on it, has the same exact uh, pattern on it as far as the fibers in there, has the same size roll, same thickness of the roll. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if Goon Tape, Goon Tape was getting it private labeled from Howie's Hockey Tape, because this is made in the USA, this is also made in the USA. Um, I'm not, I can't say that for sure, but that's just a guess. Um, but the fact of the matter is, guys, if you buy goon tape to put on your gun and you like that, which is cool, I personally don't like it. I think it's too slick. Um, I, I did not prefer it on my firearm. Honestly, I was better off not having anything on it at all in my personal preference as far as these uh, tapes go. But guys, you are literally overpaying for cloth hockey tape. So if that's what you like, go Howie's. Seriously, get a, get a Howie's uh, cloth uh, hockey tape. It's cheaper and... I feel like you're not getting screwed because that's exactly what's happening with goon tape. I mean, I kind of figured it was kind of gimmicky anyway. I, I I knew it, but I wanted to see what the hype was for myself because there's a, there is a substantial amount of people who buy it and put it on their their guns and yeah. So that's it. There, don't buy this. It's it's not good. Anyways, so what I what I went with uh, is I tried these other three. Um, I I liked this one pretty good. Uh, it was okay, and then. I tried these two. This was the stretchy tape. This is the Howie's Pro Grip Tape. And I'm somewhere in the middle between these two. Um, this is the Pro Tape, and when your hands get wet, it's not 100% the best. Like, when I say wet, I mean real wet, not just a little sweaty. Um, and then this one works a little bit better when your hands are a little wet, but this one works better when your hands are dry. Um, so most of the time, my hands are dry. I don't that they're just not very sweaty. I don't know. So for me, I went with the Pro Grip Tape, and I think it's fantastic. Um, I get a fantastic draw, um, fantastic purchase, uh, another buzzword there in the gun community, uh, on my firearm when I go to draw for concealed. Um, it doesn't rub on my stomach too much. Um, and guys, I, this is my favorite grip tape. This is fantastic. And it costs the same as the other Howie's Roll. I think it was for something. Um, you don't get as much but it's a more specialized tape. It's not just cloth. So there's different uh, materials, fibers, and um, sticky agents in there, I'm sure. So that's my guess is why the price is what it is. But guys, do not buy goon tape. It is a rip off. It is literally cloth hockey tape. If anything, buy one of these three. These were This was on Amazon, right? If you, if you wanna try this one, it's the Element 26. You can buy it on Amazon. It comes in a three pack. It's not, it's not bad. Um, I, I, I definitely would run this 100% over Goon Tape. Um, but as far as these other three right here, um, I'm going to pick the Howie's Pro Grip Tape um, or the Stretchy Tape. But right now, um, I'm moving into the uh, 
pro grip tape. Maybe maybe during the, the height of summer, I might switch to the stretchy tape to just meet my sweaty hand needs a little bit more if that ends up happening. I don't know, we'll see. It's starting to get cold and dry over here, so um, my, just, my hands just haven't been sweaty. Um, but I did get my hands wet and rubbed it on this one. It does feel a little bit better. So between these two, I think both of these are, are great options. Um, pro grip tape, stretchy tape, all from Howie's. Don't buy goon tape. You can try this Element 26 if you want. Uh, goon tape's a scam. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> that is what it is. It's a scam. It's literally just hockey tape. Honestly, uh, unpopular opinion. It's like, it's kind of like what Black Rifle Coffee does with coffee. It's coffee that's just marketed towards the gun guy. It's crap coffee. It's whatever and they just slap a cool gun guy label on it and you know all of a sudden all the gun guys are buying it. Same thing with this hockey tape. It's the same thing. They just market it towards something else, which good for them. They're making money on it. That's cool. But uh, as far as a consumer is concerned here, um, don't buy it. Buy, buy, buy Howie's. Hope that helps, guys.